time. You have quite the collection here. I've been so impressed, in fact, that I've sent along a contribution or two to the curator. Not at all, friend. Glad to help out. It's really amazing what you two are doing here, Uncle. Oh, hi. I have a fantastic opportunity for you, and it has only a small window of opportunity to do so. I was contacted by a wealthy man named Carlo Williams, who is in possession of the staff of the Dark City. path to elsewhere. I was wondering when that would start. Uh, boom! Look at that. We're so awesome. Jagged crown. Don't have that, clearly. Nostrous helmet, which we don't have. Uh, cool. Aha! Oh, nice. That looks really cool. The Prince of Madness. Awesome. Ring of Hearsing. That's cool that they light up. I like that. Really adds to it. Dusk and Dawn, Spoils of the Hunt, Juxtaposition, Binding of the Undead. Boom! Awesome. Boethia's Ward, Rueful Axe, Volan Rude, Mace of Molag Ball, Spellbreaker, Ring of Namira, Sanguine's Rose, Marin's Razor, Jiglag Sword. Oh, what? Hi! Okay. I'm over encumbered now, aren't I? No, I'm not. What was it? It was the. Looks like a weapon. Cleaver of St. Felms. Oh, wow. That looks really cool, but I'm not going to use it because it's weak. But I'll definitely, you know, thank you. Mask of Clavicus Vile. That concerns me because how are we supposed to get the Mask of Clavicus Vile and the Rufal Axe? I mean, it would kind of suck if I had to do two playthroughs just to get both of those things. Although I suppose they're not really too difficult to get your hands on if you really think about it, so. Boom, here, seeing Ritual Mask. Alright, good work. Love and Hate. Adra and Daedra displays. Uh, yep, it's all the stuff from the Mad Maskar. That's all this stuff, pretty much. Uh, so, you know. That was weird. Hello, everybody. 204 here. Uh, we're here in Dawnstar. Uh, I got the idea to sort of walk walk around the beach when I was talking to a individual who was playing this game as well. Uh, I thought it'd be fun to walk along the beach and try and find some shit. So that's what we're here doing. We're going to kill some horkers. It'd be great. Uh, do I still have my sword? Yes, I do, but it's not marked like it should be. Three. There we go. That was interesting. It said there was a, a shift uh, in the world. Uh, I do wonder what that was. I don't know. No, no way of me knowing that. Uh, spooky, though. Very spooky. Hi, Horkers. Get horked! Oh. Two hand increase to fifty, you know what that means. Now we can do a power attack. Boom, while running. We can go like this, ready? Bam! Look how much health that did. Holy shit. Oh, fuck that guy up pretty good. Oh I'm out of stamina. See that's the problem, I run out of stamina super quickly. No matter. We can easily outrun the Horkers because they are not quick. They are really, really slow. 
And that's the glory of them. It's like this horrendously like this this battle music. And you turn around, you see them oh, lumbering towards you. Sweet. Yes, there is a, a, a seashell collection as part of this. Uh, and when I was speaking with the person, uh, they said that they were walking along the shores and they got a whole bunch of she she. I am terrible. Seashells. Mm-hmm. Along the way. I was like, cool. Seashells by the seashore. She sells seashells by the seashore. That is impossible to say. But I said it anyway. So keep your eye open uh, for things like that. Uh, you know, we obviously want to pick those up and right as I put it away, put them in the museum. And we can't put them in the museum if we don't have them. <laughs> obviously. Ooh. Well, we have a starfish, firstly. A scimitar, daughter of Nibbin Book. Okay, cool. Nordic Barnacle Cluster, all normal stuff. But I'm gonna take that scimitar, just because it looks kind of unique and new. Paula, Volume 1, we'll take that. A Tribunal Golden Mask. Did we get the Golden Mask or did we get the Bronze one? I don't remember. Let's take a look at the scimitar, though. Um, scimitar! Ooh, very nice. I like it. Hopefully putting away my uh, sword won't bring more wolves down on my head. Uh, one can hope anyway. Hold on just one moment. Sorry about that wait. They see a wolf over there. Hopefully they don't come and try to bite me. I'd like that wolf to live and if it comes and attacks me it will be dead. So let's let's hope for the best here. I don't want to miss anything. I feel like I have to search all these little outcroppings so I don't miss any uh, seashells by the seashore. It's seashore. Seashore. Are you so sure that it's seashore? I'm not convinced. See? So it happens. You hardly do any damage to me, and then you're dead. You gotta count your blessings. Oh! A soft orange. Nice. I don't actually know where these go in the dis in the gallery. If I had to guess, it's probably going to be this, the the uh, Hall of Natural Sciences or something like that. <clears throat> Let's move out over here. Swimming in the sea. Oh, we're swimming in the sea. Getting some clam meat. In the sea. Is it just me or is it a bit clammy? <gasps> uh, 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 ooh. Oh, cool. A large green shell. Wow. This is a good way to boost our number of stuff in the uh, gallery. The gallery is full of mostly seashells. You are wrong. Ha ha ha. Yeah! One hit KO. Alright, that's what I'm talking about. I'm just gonna walk very slowly away from you to see if there's any seashells on this cropping over here. And there's not. And I put this away. I need my stamina to come back just slightly quicker. Really? My heavy armor increased? Why? Ah! Boom! Get wrecked! Alright. Here is a boat. What do we have here? I see what is probably another seashell. And... That was right! Aww. More clam meat! Clam meat, clam meat, clam meat. The wreck of the. Fuck. Brian Hammer. Uh, there's some dead things over there. Uh, 
Ooh. Oh, don't want to run out of oxygen. Ah, shit. Hey, nice. Lock pick and gold. Lock pick and gold. Lock pick and gold. Lock pick and gold. Oh, mud crab. Ha! Ah! So we're in the wreck of the brine hammer. There is a father of Nibbin. Uh, book, which we've just taken. And just a lot of generic, generic stuff down here, yeah. Not too much. Just a lot of stuff on the floor and stuff. Let's go uh, up here into the below deck of the Brine Hammer. The Brine Hammer! Ah! Not cool. I don't like being attacked. Uh, all right, nice bedding. Could take a nap if we wanted to. That'd be cool. The Ransom of Zarek, part one. I'll take it. Novice door. Bam. That door didn't stand a chance. Ah! Bad giant mud crab. That hurts. Mm -hmm. You know, I normally, in a standard game, I would not be exploring this place. Oh no, I don't want to go up there. But, there's a good opportunity, there's, there's a good chance that there's something, you know, hidden on this ship that we want. There's always that chance with Legacy of the Dragonborn, and that is why it's fun to play. Where does this go? Open. Nowhere. What's in this chest? Gold and a potion of magicka. Oh, look! A fairy! Sweet! You got another one. I haven't seen one of those since, like, episode 15, I feel like. Not since uh, Moon and Star, I don't think. That feels like a long time ago. Let's go back below deck here. Below deck. Um, let me sort of continue on here. Shrine of Kinnereth. Huh. Demon! Ooh. Cyrus's saber. I'll take it. Yes. It's all the unique thing that we can put in the freaking museum. Take that quicksilver ingot too. Ow! Bad. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I feel every time I turn it's like it's really kind of disorienting. Cargo hold and the door's locked. Why? Why is the door locked? And why is the rum gone? <laughs> Outdated references. I am a master lock picker. I'll get through this. Hey, hey, told you. Boom. Now we're going down to a separate part of the cargo hold, or am I, did I just, I just took different stairs. Well, all right, that was, that was interesting. Um, chain here. Mm-hmm, 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 aha. All right, here we go. We can do this. We're a little bit low on lock picks. So we're sort of uh, playing with fire here. Hey, there we go. No! Ah. We did it! We get cards, that, a gold diamond ring, lock picks in, and a magical potion. All for our troubles. How awesome is that? Well, I guess these floorboards are the reason that we're kind of, uh, you know, shipwrecked here. Yeah, huh? Woo! Splish. 
Well, cool. That was fun. Just exploring a nice, you know, boat. Do you guys remember in um, Oblivion, there was that one uh, helm, remember? The one that you had to go off, like, the coast of uh, Anvil, and then you had to find it, and it was, like, impossible to find. Yeah. That one was awesome. I thought I was going to get that first, and it would turn everything blue because it had an eye eye. That was a cool one. I liked that one. But, uh, yeah. It's pretty, pretty awesome. No such luck, though. I don't know if anything like that has ever been in Skyrim. And if there is, I wonder, I don't think anyone's found it. I mean, I'm, I mean, you probably would have found it just with the modding tools, but you never know. And that's, that's the glory. Uh, whew, excuse me. I didn't mean to uh, yawn there. If I made you yawn, I'm sorry. I know yawns are contagious and I didn't mean to infect you. What is that? Is that just a, a nice little nothings ruin? I'm gonna kill that orker. Told you. Dead, dead, dead. Has a door now. It's okay. That one. That one didn't notice. We won't bring it up. We'll just let him discover the body on his own. <laughs> it's terrible. Okay, uh... I don't know. Let's, I don't know. Let's go over to that icy thing. That looks interesting. Where are we? Oh, yeah, it's an icy rock. We'll just swim over to it and see what's going on. Can we get over that far? I don't actually know, to be honest. I think it might stop us pretty pretty quick here if we try to get too close. I don't know if we can explore that glacier. We'll see. So far so good. Can't really get up on it. Let's get up right here. See the glaciers. Oh, come on. There we go. Up on it here now. Jump on it. Jump. What is that? Is that a, is that a chunk error? I didn't know this game could have chunk errors. How strange. Let's go take a look. At the chunk error. Because now I'm curious. I swim into this, am I gonna die? Will the water just disappear? Oh, nope. I can just see the whole ocean now. That's cool. Jump on one of these here. I don't know. What do we have over there? Not much. But yeah, interesting the things you find if you just, you know, look around for them. There is the Solitude Lighthouse, actually. Well, uh, we didn't do a whole lot in this episode. Uh, we did put a lot of stuff in the library just at the beginning there. Um, but yeah, that was pretty much it. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I've been two or four. Uh, and I'll catch you guys on the flippity flop side. Ugh. Sorry, just stretching. Until then, uh, be good to each other. And I hope you have a good day. And be sure to wash your car. Alright, bye-bye now.